brilliant. In the UK alone there are over 4,000 species and they are a vital part of a healthy garden. Beetles not only form an important part of the food chain, feeding larger animals such as hedgehogs and birds, they also help to recycle nutrients, eating and digesting plant matter and returning goodness back into the soil. Sadly, many of our beetles are under threat from habitat loss, with populations affected by the use of pesticides. You can learn more about the threats facing our brilliant beetles and find help and advice on avoiding pesticide use in the link in the description. Even if you have a small garden, creating a beetle bucket is a great way to introduce habitat space. Here's what you'll need. A bucket or trug or other durable recycled container, a small craft knife, some stones, bark chips or garden leaves, small logs that will sit upright in your container and a spade. I'm going to pop my beetle bucket into a vegetable bed and I'm going to plant it up with wildflowers this season but you can pop it into a flower bed or even under a hedge wherever you have space. First job is to cut holes in the bucket for the beetles to get in and out. Next, dig a hole just larger than your bucket and sink it into the ground. Put some large stones at the bottom of the bucket and stand some logs upright on top. These will eventually rot down and make lovely spots for female beetles to lay their eggs. Fill the rest of the bucket with bark chippings or garden leaves, leaving about 10 centimetres at the top to fill with some soil dug from the ground. Top the soil with a couple of logs to tempt beetles in from above or below. If you want to help bring back beetles, pledge to create your own habitat by heading to wildaboutgardens.org.uk and download your free booklet.